at the time of recruitment of the police service, there was an indication, there was a circular, that anybody who has a degree and enters into the police service automatically is promoted to a cadet police officer. He gets the salary and the rank of a police officer. Many of our clients took loans to start pursuing their degrees, and once they got their degrees, they were allowed to receive the emoluments or the salaries of graduate police cadet inspectors. Suddenly, without notice, without any reason, the National Police Service Commission decided to recruit directly from the public graduates to join in. Then they deducted the salaries of those who have been in service. Remember, they have been receiving the salaries of graduates. They have taken loans based on the pay slips. They have taken mortgages based on the pay slips. They have committed themselves based on the pay slips. So these officers had a legitimate expectance that they will continue earning the salaries and allowances of graduate police officers. The National Police Service has now done the worst by reducing them, demoting them to constables, and deducting their salaries, which is contrary to the International Labor Organization Convention and other labor laws. So we filed that matter so that they can be reinstated back to their office, uh, to their ranks. This has affected the morale within the police service, and this is likely to affect especially the Kenyans at this time of the festivities when we need police services to be alert, to be uh, vigilant, and to be motivated. So we file our matter. We are expecting directions from the court because that is fundamentally an abuse on the human rights violations of these police officers.